This will be one of our best pets, if not our best pet that we can possibly get. Doppelganger, attempt number six. After becoming the richest player in Spawn PK and obtaining every possible unlock, I decided it's time to try something new. Introducing Bronzed Out, my Bronze Man mode account. Inspired by Framed and Goody, Bronze Man mode is a custom Iron Man mode just for PvP. Items must be unlocked self-sufficiently or through PK. Additionally, after an item is unlocked, I can buy and sell them on the trading post forever with the ultimate goal of max PK gear. Look to skill skull. Interesting, a cursed orb. We would very much like to kill him. Nice 40. Another hit here. Oh, we're gonna be real careful. No. Oh yes, hell yeah. Beautiful. I thought for a second that we lost that that interaction, but we did not. Very nice. Look at that. Boom. There's the 50 billion cash. Grand all ore. Blood money. Hell yeah. Very very worth it. Go up to 1M Gods 22. We really want his Swift Blade. That'd be sick. We probably won't get it. Oh. Come on, Axe. Oh, come on, Axe. Give me a, give me another big hit. Kill him. Brought up the chance. Damn, I tried. Ooh, I ate all I could. Rest in peace, me. As you guys saw, I did a bunch of Blood Slayer there, so we're at 3,500 points. We've also got a bunch of merches that have come through, mystery chests all sold, a bunch of our blood chanting stones also sold, not all of them yet, but they will in time. Look at that, we are now back at 10,809 uh, cash bags, and there's essentially 1.8 trillion here. These are just in case somebody decides to buy it. So, you know, hopefully we can get that money in soon. Cash stack chilling at almost 1.4 trill, nice. I also did a skilling task that I just didn't record. Uh, let's see if we can get anything from this casket. There's a lot of potential unlocks. You can get a cursed relic from this, and we did not. We got a fancy mystery box, which is actually an unlock, but a useless one. What do we get from that? We've now unlocked the chicken wings and the chicken legs. Eggs, both of which are completely useless, but they are technically unlocks. Behemoth Elemental, what do we get? Uh, nothing. Also had five blood shedding stones in the bank that we created. I don't know if I recorded those, but I think I did. And we'll put those right here with these. Boom, 23 blood shedding stones. We got a bunch of blood core. All we need is blood shards, and then we're good to go to make more. Got 19 donator mystery boxes. Uh, I think I bought a bunch from the from the blood fountain. Let's see if we get anything good. Is Magic Fang an unlock? I think it's not. We already have that, right? Yeah, we do. We have three of them. Wow. Devout boots are always good. Great, it's like 20 bill. Hands helm, nice. Blood money, okay. Blowpipe, more AGSs. Frost whip, Serp helm. Elite void top, wait, 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 wait. Yes, there we go. Elite void top completed. That's super nice. Once we get uh, void army kits, that's going to be really, really useful. Beautiful. Elite void top unlocked. Two more. Magma helm and donator tickets. That that void piece is just mwah, fantastic. Also did a lot of Karazi grinding, which I'll show you guys in a bit. Going to sell all of our devout boots here for 230 each. It's going to be like an extra, I don't know, 100 bill that we just didn't have before. Very nice. I'm going to take these out because I don't like it that it's so skewed for my TP price. Um, I don't even have these on my main. I, I, I regret buying them. It was, I thought it would help me out. Get, get tickets faster and it did not. Trading ticket or trading sticks, not tickets. There's PvP boxes in the fountain right now and they're pretty decent profit margin, I think. So I'm gonna buy out all the all the boxes I can. Put these in the TP. We're gonna end up with what is that? One a uh, 249 boxes, I think. Boom, there we go. 27 
433 bags in there, plus I think a trill in here, which leaves us with, I mean, a lot of profit from those, those stones. But I also have blood diamonds in the bank. I've got blood core. Like, I got 322 blood diamonds. I've got a bunch of blood core. Two, 2625 in there. Like, we're, we're doing pretty well. Got an elder chaos druid here. Maybe this is the day. Maybe it's not. It is not the day. So I found this guy at Elder Chaos Druids who's in pure range. I'm wondering, oh, I'm level 102, hold on. I gotta change my stats, but I'm gonna kill him because it's gonna be a free emblem upgrade and I have a task that's that's a two-handed weapon right now. All right, let's get this this free emblem right here. I really wanna get this guy right now. Is he not here anymore? Did he leave? Oh man, oh, he's here. Oh man, kill him. Come on, finish him off. He's protecting melee. Kill him. There we go. No, come on. There we go. Okay, that's weird that um, he wasn't my target at all, but I guess I'll take it. Well, either way, some stuff in the TP sold. We sold 150 of the PvP boxes, four devout boots, and 12 of the blood shedding stones. We're at 1.5 trill cash again. So the second I find more blood shards, I am ready to go. I also did a mini me attempt earlier because a doppel would just be the best thing possible for us. I'm going to do another one right now. I know it's silly. I know we just lost a lot of our profit, but it's kind of worth it because eventually, and the earlier we get this, the better. This will be one of our best pets, if not our best pet that we can possibly get. Doppelganger attempt number six. Rip. This will be our last attempt at this for now. I promise we, we, we won't do another unless I feel like it, which I might feel like it if I lose this right here right now. <gasps> number seven gone let's go for number eight and this is the last one because it's the last one at 1500 i i i know this pet's gonna cost me like six or seven trill in the long run but i really would like it eight attempts gone that sounds about right infernal kraken what do we get nothing we got 16 larynx keys to open i'm gonna do this here we go always always so scary all right let's get it started stamina pots okay claws eh tacit's nice combat pots okay these are all kind of subpar what was that cash okay dams combat Blood money. We want the gold artifacts, baby. And a stone would be nice, too. I wouldn't mind a stone artifact. Nothing, 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 and nothing. All right. This was our total loot. Not amazing. So for those wondering why we're going... I think I already explained this, but we need the Karamja Gloves 3 from, uh, from Karazi. I'm tempted to go back there now. I can actually afford the Karazi top and bottoms now. I've got over 500 blood money, which is really sick. Um, I don't know if I want to bring those back here or what I want to do, but, you know... Things are going things are going pretty well on that front. Wait, I need to finish this off so I can get a huge chunk of money here. Jeez. Um, I'll go do that, and then I might head over to Karazi. I think this is the daily completed. Nice. Yeah, it's a double, so I figured I'd do it. Look at that nice 20 bill cash, two treasure caskets, and some blood shards. 13 treasure caskets. What do we get? 100 blood shards, 134 cash bags. Uh, eh, not that bad. Not amazing, though. Also got a bunch of goodie bags. Uh, again, these are vote tickets and sometimes blood core, too. So we have 39 in the bank, all from Elder Cast Roots. Nice three vote tickets. Four more, and what we get? How many vote tickets we get from all that? Let's see. Oh, only five? Ugh. So some stuff sold in the TP as well. Look at that. All the blood chanting stones and the Tebow. Oh, I bought a Tebow for 1,400 bags and sold it for 1,470. So a little profit there. Back at 18662. Again, the, the money is just flowing constantly because these are high, high volume items that are constantly bought and sold. Um, we got 240 bill in there. We've got so much in blood core. I got like a trail in blood core alone. The blood shards are just so hard to come by. I think I can head up to Karazi now, right? Yeah, nice. Okay, cool. I think I'm gonna unlock the Karazi top and legs because I can, and it would help with a lot of DPS for the stuff that I'm doing outside of the wilderness. Um, you know, stuff where I don't have to worry about risk. So I can currently afford the Karazi top at least. So I'm gonna get that. And I'm gonna use it for my jungle dailies for a sec because it's just, it's such a big DPS increase that it's really worth it to have on here. The only worry I have is losing it because you can get PK'd here, but I usually don't stay long enough to get PK'd. And no matter what, it's still going to be an unlock. Karazi leather body or chaps, I'm going to go body unlocked. Big unlock. This is used frequently for the wandering merchant. It is a very, very good body. Look at this. Plus 27 range attack and plus four rank strength. So, you know, very useful for the jungle demon if I'm safe spawning it with range. So yeah, good stuff to come. Oh, just got a rune crossbow, which is super nice. Um, I'm going to keep that in my storage because I have very limited bolts or very, very limited arrows, but I have a shit ton of bolts. I'm going to do a quick jungle demon kill. Then I'm going to organize my stuff and get out. I might keep the body on here actually, because it's, it's really useful. Like the kills are so much faster and this isn't a daily. I don't have a, I, it hasn't been enough time to do a daily, but um, I want a chance to the Sun Spear, you know, 101k. And Jungle Demon down. Do we get anything? Let's see. 
trading sticks. All right, not that many either. All right, I'm gonna leave the island. I'm at 723 sticks, 213 blood money. I just need 37 more blood money uh, of Karazi stuff, or for, for the Karazi legs, and then uh, so many more trading sticks, but I'm gonna get it before before the next Wanderer day, hopefully. And we're out. But beyond the island, what that means is that I can get myself a Karazi leather body off of the island, right? So this here is gonna be my new best in slot range gear. How gorgeous is that? Boom, Karazi leather body off of the island unlocked. Bought a bunch of blood money because again, profit can be made here. We're almost at 100,000, wow, that's kind of nuts. Oh baby, the best stuff we could possibly get here. Mystery chests and donator mystery boxes, gorgeous. The highest profit margin items. Mystery chests are very high profit, let me let me calculate. Mystery chests are five bill profit each. Ooh, but boxes, it turns out, are uh, on average. No, okay, so yeah, mystery chests are definitely the way to go. We're gonna buy out a shit ton of mystery chests, I guess. Boom, and let's get the rest of these bad boys, boom. This is going to elevate our TP quite a lot. It's five bill profit each. I'll put this in at 387 each. This will more than cover what we spent on, on, on mini me's for the doppel attempts. Trying hard to get blood shards asking everywhere. In the meantime, donator boxes bought six of them. What do we get? Claws, vengeance skull, okay. Throne axes, arcane, AGS, so stat hammer, meh. Gonna buy a blood key for 1350 and doing a little YOLO because again, we need to do these to eventually unlock the dark Rossi. So not a problem here with doing this grand blood key. Let's do it. Boom. On casket. A scythe, okay. A scythe and mystery chest is not bad at all. It's like 430 bill from that. Nice. Gonna do a bit of PKing. Good luck to Salty Rex. Gotta be real careful because I haven't PK'd in a while. Okay. Well, that was good timing on his part. I thought maybe he would go for something, but he didn't. All right, good fight. Uh, that was pretty nice. What we got? Oh, tier 10 there. And Vesta skirt and top and granite ace. And that's going to be our seventh Mysterious Emblem Tier 10. Um, we are working towards, folks. We are working towards getting 50 points, 50 million points, which will be 10 of the emblems. Fighting Best PKR 181. Good luck. We're probably dead. This guy knows what he's doing, whereas I don't super know what I'm doing. Just a little bit, you know? Next week, we could get an easy bench combo on him. Nope. Oh? Oh, dude. Oh, if I just use the, uh, the shield... Like if I if I had done that last time, oh, nah, he's not gonna die. <sighs> I wasted my chance. 